you know, mental health is a taboo subject that hardly anybody wants to talk about and really don't like going into depth about it until something happens to you personally or someone that you know. Uh, and I want to reach out uh, to everyone in regards to make sure you talk to somebody. A lot of times, uh, life beats us down with our stresses and the different things that happen to us in life. And we hold so much stuff in, compartmentalize it. And when we get so overwhelmed with life, it's like a volcano exploding. And so I just want to just tell everybody, listen, try to talk to somebody. Talk to a family, friend. If it's something you don't really want to confide into them, uh, hell, a stranger. Go get a therapist. Hell, if, you, if you have to, go talk to a damn tree to get it out. Because far too often we see situations where, you know, people can go postal at work. People can kill family members and things like that. Well, you know that was a probably... A, a sane, stable person, but something called that is the crack. And a lot of times, you know, especially when I hear about stuff like that, the first thing I'm thinking is, where are their friends at? You know, do they have anybody to talk to? Just automatically in my mind, because I've been in the same situation where I've had so stressful things going on, never went to the point where I want to just, you know, hurt anybody or hurt myself, but more so I know how it is just, you know, have all that stuff coming down on you, and you just need to talk. And you be walking sometimes, you see a complete damn stranger, they may say, how you doing? And the next thing you know, you're talking for the next 10, 15 damn minutes, getting all this stuff off your chest. Not intentionally, you just were holding so much stuff in. So I just want to advise people that when, you, you know, life's beating you down, you're feeling real bad, you got a lot of stuff going on in your mind, don't be scared to let that out. Find somebody to talk to. Again, I know how some people, we, we have people that we're more comfortable with and just at that point in time, you might just can't get in contact with them, okay? But... The worst thing I want, the last thing rather I want people to do is be holding stuff in and do something impulsive because you, you know, didn't get a chance to think, didn't get a chance to reflect, or didn't get yourself uh, that opportunity to do those things. So please, 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 again, don't hold stuff in. Don't struggle with stuff in silence, okay? Don't do it. It won't help you at all. Again, it's bad for you know, your mental stability, it can help, it can hurt you internally and everything. So try to find some way to express yourself. You know, again, it may not even be verbally. You may just draw something, maybe go work out, maybe go uh, fix on your car or something. But regardless, don't try to internalize stress. Don't try to internalize pain. Again, mental health is just so serious and people just never want to address it until the, uh, it's too late. And God forbid, I hate turning on the TV because... You know, this person snapped or that person snapped because of something they couldn't get out or they didn't get a chance to think or they didn't, you know, they just didn't, you know, you know, you know, move in the right path that could have helped them handle that situation a lot better. So please, 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 if you have the opportunity, try to talk to someone, seek some counsel or whatever, you know, but that was just on my heart. I want to stress that to anybody, to, to everybody that, that's willing to listen to that uh, today. Again, this is Deontay Burden. Host to change your lives. Make sure you uh, like, share, and subscribe to the YouTube channel. And as always, make sure you hit that blue man in the bottom right hand corner. Take care.